hello you, welcome to Geekers, and we've got Vikings invading, hopefully it won't cause too much of an issue. Last time they came, they got like to here and did a little bit of Bernie Burn and ran off again, but they didn't really get anything there. Uh, anything major, it wasn't too much of a problem. Uh, so, hello, it's been a little while um, since I've recorded a video, but this probably will come out after uh, videos are back on the channel. I don't think it's going to be the... This isn't going to be how we sort of relaunch after the holiday, but this is the first thing I'm filming after the time I've had off. Uh, if you didn't know already, uh, me, uh, myself and the wife went and had a little baby. So um, we've had a couple of weeks to uh, to get acquainted with him. And uh, he's doing great. Uh, he's doing fantastic, in fact. And, uh, and I've now got a little bit of a routine with him now, which leaves me uh, with a bit of time to be able to play some video games with you guys again. Uh, so that's great to hear. So um, where we left this, we've basically just done a little bit of a start. I know a lot of you uh, got this game and have sort of been play was playing along with me, so I'm assuming you're now way ahead of me. Uh, but thank you very much for the comments in the last episode. Uh, you've given me a bit of a uh, update as to what I can actually kind of get away with re here really so uh, first things first what we can do is we can add a second quarry uh, to I can't remember how to do any of this but we can there we go we can add a second quarry to uh, a stone and that is uh, and the stone it will never run out as well and the other big thing is you can build a forester um, who will uh, who will make trees for you basically because that was one of the big problems in this I thought was that trees were going to be a, a, a really tough resource to keep hold of. So um, we're going to build it up here and kind of repopulate this um, this little forest that we cut down. So first of all, let's get a road going up from the, from the castle here, I think. Um, and we'll bring it out this way. We might even, oops, might even have a couple of little houses along here as well. That might be quite nice. Uh, one more maybe. And we'll start a little bit of industrial area here as well because we've got some iron here that we'll be able to uh, mine in a, in a little while as well. So uh, let's have a look. Industry, forester. Uh, oh, he needs to be closer to trees in the first place, do you? Okay, so let's put you there then. And let's just carry the road up a little to you. And then here then, let's have a look regarding quarry. Is it a special that we need an iron mine? to go on. I'm pretty sure that was iron, yeah. Okay, so we've got that there for the future as well. Good stuff. Have these Vikings made it round to us? No, it looks like they've cleared off. So that's pretty good. Um, we'll let them carry on getting those few trees there because eventually we probably want to work into that area a little bit. Somebody's telling us a few things here. Uh, peasants are starving. Starving? Oh my god, they've got absolutely no food. What's happened there? Good day, good day. Yeah, great. Where's all that food gone? Is it because we've got not got the stockpile open? Uh, Alright, let's get it open then. And hopefully it won't mean that we've got anyone idle. We've got 60 people here. I think the problem is when we open that stockpile, because it's a big one. Uh, see, look, loads of food, look. That's great, yeah? And that all goes into there. Small granary. And then it all goes straight back out again. Is that, is that what's happening, or is it... Yeah, granary's going up, and then it's all getting fed straight back out into houses. Okay, so I think we're going to need some more food. I think that's probably what this game is telling us. So, uh, food. Let's get another orchard on the go. Let's build it. Uh, soil is not fertile enough. Oh, how annoying. Uh, but there it is. Um, let's do it there, then. And let's do a... When we can, we'll put a small granary across the... Although, actually, we'd like the wall to go there, wouldn't we, I think? We've got these farms here that we might have to move. See, something's on fire there. Pretty sure our wells are covered. Let's have a look. We've noticed that if you click these, it gives you a um, an area of effect, basically. So our town square covers all our houses here. Our tavern covers all these. Our well is not covering this farm. Right, okay, so we need another well up here. Um, let's get that in straight away. Um, because otherwise we're going to have major problems in the future. Let's do it there should just cover everything we've got um, what are you telling me you're gonna tell me something awful's happened peasants are starving again my word what has happened we do we seem to have unless there's been an update while I've not played we seem to produce more than enough food beforehand and now we just don't seem like we are in fact four people look like they've died how oh dear oh dear oh dear what's um what's going on here Forrester um 
needs a full staff to replant and there is nobody working there um, yeah it looks like people are dying looks like we just haven't got the food intake needed that might be that second quarry that we've built maybe let's let's close you hopefully you'll fill up other jobs we now have one worker so at least you'll go and cut stuff down uh, you all have workers don't you yeah so the food is uh, you one of you don't there okay hopefully that well will stop farms in the future getting burnt down let's speed it up a little bit let a bit of time pass uh, you're going to tell me people are starving again aren't you yeah okay not really much I can do about that at the moment pal but thanks for letting me know see look there's the food it comes in and it pretty much goes straight back out again worry about food for the winter uh, yeah, they're actually telling me they're starving now. There are actually little pe little loaves of bread above the houses that are telling me. Grow unhappy. Some have no access to a library or church. Mate, I've got more than enough things to worry about at the moment than libraries and churches. Okay, so our well is up and running, uh, which should mean we shouldn't have a problem uh, from these farms burning down. So let's get you there and you there and then we'll carry on building out some more regular farms here oops and we're just gonna we're just gonna keep building these until um, until we're kind of built as many as we need where have they gone industry no food yeah um, okay no fertile enough no okay so we'll have them here okay there we go so that's another five farms and we can stick something here I guess like a little building we can put oh we put a windmill before didn't we should we have another windmill um repairs damaged structures with stone ah that's interesting probably stick one of you somewhere as well um where was windmill there so we need some wood for windmill okay so wood should be should be doing alright for wood now um worry about food and we have new construction but it's not happening because there's no people free okay and those three houses are starving because of it okay so we need more people here um one peasant has left the kingdom see look food 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 is coming in so i just think at the moment the problem is we're just not making enough food yeah that seems to be the problem. Food comes in, food goes back out, but it's not leaving us anything in reserve. So we're, we're just making enough food to live. Um, we need to close this stockpile for a moment and get these farms built. I think we need to build a small stockpile. Is there a way to get rid of a building? Uh, demolish. Yeah, let's get rid of that stockpile and build a small one. Because I think that could be one of the problems at the moment is that we just uh, didn't have enough space. So let's build a few of these around instead. Um, oops. No industry. Small stockpile. One there. We'll have one over here. That's That's a good spot for a stockpile, I think. And we won't put one there because we'll probably have some bigger houses there. Okay. So hopefully, as people will move stuff from there across to there, we can also have um, a stockpile here. Um, here. Whoops. Keep pressing right click to rotate, but it's not. It's middle mouse. We'll have one there, and that should maybe take the wood and stone from over here. So kind of happy with that. Hopefully having that place shut means that all these farms are now fully operational. No, still nobody working on that one or that one. We're losing people. That's the problem. Losing people thick and fast. But hopefully, as awful as it sounds, through losing people, the people we have got should keep fed. Um, okay, so it seems to be that food is a problem. I have a feeling there's been a bit of a balancing pass. Unless that I just grew very quickly at the end of the last episode and didn't quite notice that's anything i'm thinking might have happened um so we have enough beds for 60 people a few people have turned up so that's good let's build a couple more of these larger houses 
Um, actually, let's just actually let's just check. Are all our food two out of three workers? Two out of three. Zero. No, so there's still a few of these places that just aren't actually being um, being looked after. So until we've got enough people to man all the farms, I'm not going to build any more houses. So we'll leave that like that. Stock the the wood stock is doing fantastic. They're growing trees. They're making trees. Um, it looks like that isn't an issue anymore. They're just cutting stuff down and building it. That's great. Um, church and library. Let's have a look at those then. Town. Church needs a lot of stuff. Actually, no, just a bit more wood than we have. Uh, library we can actually build. Maybe we should build a library that's suitable for this little village down here. Um, if we put it there, we will get pretty much every house in. And it's kind of on the town square. It kind of makes sense. Um, let's have a look how it looks. It's a cute building. I think that's probably the uh, the way to go, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. So we'll build that there. Library should make people happier. Um, nobody's available to work. Oh, we've seen now we are full of people again, so that's fine. So as long as all these are full. No, not you. Yeah. Three, one, one. Yeah. Okay. So it looks like all the farms are full. Uh, food storage is doing okay. So I think we could probably start working on a couple more houses to get some more people in. So I still want to build cottages. Tempted to build them that way around. Um, I think that would look quite interesting, wouldn't it, actually? It doesn't seem to matter which way they go around. They can seem to access it from any which way. Uh, a few more bits of wood needed. Uh, and we can build another one. Let's just hold on and see how quick that wood comes in. Two. Uh, we might, oh, we've got 63 people now. So we should have. People seem to be coming over here and doing stuff. Which is good. One more wood. Come on. There we go. And we'll build you there. And that can be our sort of higher end bit of town as people come in. I'm pretty happy with that. Okay. What you can, uh, this is annoying me, this little thing that's always here. Because they're just saying the same thing over and over again. Food stars are low. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Okay, library's up and running. So that's given us um, one of 20 knowledge. Okay. <laughs> uh, we need some staff for that. So once these houses are done, hopefully we'll keep increasing. I think we need to work on another set of farms. So here looks like a good area for that. Um, so let's go to uh, road and build it out this way a little. Uh, let's go to there and then we'll go to town we'll do a few hovels along here as well I think once we can we've got a fire but it's it's within well distance that's good talking of well distance let's get another one over here to cover the forest building and those few buildings there food wise we're just gonna have farms here oh the sand isn't quite f the the the, uh, the ground sorry isn't quite fertile enough along some of it, never mind, um, just that one isn't, so we can build a little storage thing there or something, so let's go here, 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 and here, okay, so that gives us seven more farms, um, once we've got a bit more wood, a windmill would be quite good there, and I think think that's probably going to keep us going for a little while so we're getting a lot of food come up even off even off those little ones there we got food um some of them are unhappy they still want a church that's fine we do need to start thinking about another uh, another little sort of town center really where we can put a church in i'm assuming these have coverage yeah see a lot of the uh these few houses here aren't getting access to their library unfortunately um Gaining knowledge over time, knowledge is happiness. Oh, so that just gets better and better as it goes. That's good to know. Right, let's carry this uh, this road up to here because that would makes perfect sense to do that. And um, we can get rid of these as well. There is a rock removal thing once we've got a bit more wood and something else. I'm not sure. He's about to die. You're about to die. Oh, okay. 
Uh, a terrible plague has swept the land. That's what that is. Okay. Uh, we now have 75 people. Wood, our food seems to be sorted. We're now back on top of food, which is great. Um, so I think we could probably think about charcoal. Um, let's have a look what charcoal does. It needs to come up to here, really. So it's kind of a bit more. It's a bit more industrial, isn't it? Charcoal. Let's put it there. And see what happens. I know. I know a lot of the houses are telling me they want charcoal. Um, they need a church or libraries. That's fine. We could do. Maybe let's do a church. No, oh, no. We haven't got quite not enough wood. Uh, all right. We'll keep working on it. Hospital. Did we build a hospital in the last episode? Something's on fire there, but they should be able to manage that. Excuse me. <coughs> oh dear. Okay, so that's just give us enough wood to build a lot of things. Looks like 25s are pretty standard. Um, building on water. I would like to maybe do that here to have our wall all the way around. We actually have quite a bit of stone, so let's maybe build up our, uh, our wall a little. Um, we'll come to here with it, I think. Or... Now we'll come to here. There we go, that's going to run us out of stone box things. Yeah, stone is a, is a big one, isn't it? Uh, here we go, everything seems okay. What are you telling me? Viking raiders may be coming. Okay, so there's not really much we can do about that. We've got a couple of archery areas. I'm sure this had an archery on at some point. Um. Looks like it's that's been blown up, unfortunately. So we'll just kind of have to see how we get on. Uh, but overall, I think that's a pretty decent expansion. We've basically sorted out the food problem that we had at the end of the last episode, although I didn't realise we did have one, but I'm pretty sure that's probably what's happened. Um, we haven't got a treasure room. I mean, we've got a treasure room, sorry, we don't need one. Um, let's just get a small stop part in there. Is there anything else that might be useful apart from the... Um, windmill. Maybe the stockpile's probably good enough. As you know, the ones that we've got aren't really full, are they? So let's instead look at working towards that windmill once we have the wood. Uh, Viking raiders are on there. Let's have a look. Okay, so they are. Oh, they've landed pretty close this time. Um, so these are probably going to come in and do some fair old damage, I think, because I don't think any of our archery towers are going to reach them. This could be bad. This could be a uh, an awful ending. That can't be allowed, going through the sea like that. This could be an awful ending to our video, this episode. They're doing crazy damage. They're here, they're rioting, they're looting, they're pillaging. Some of the people have just come and got into the water with them. Oh, they've gone to get water. Oh, that's good. They can go and get water out of there. They're doing their best to put things out. Kind of hoping the Vikings just do a bit of Bernie Bernie and then clear off. I'd be relatively happy if that's what happened. They're doing a lot of Bernie Bernie, to be fair. But hopefully... Our guys can manage. They seem to be doing a pretty decent job. And it already looks maybe like they're on the way out. I'm not sure. They just seem to be... Doesn't seem to be any rhyme or reason to them. They don't. It's not like they're not like a tower defense. You know, they're not working towards the the, uh, the castle or anything like that. Seems to be that they're just kind of they come they come in, they burn everything, and they clear off again. So I think as long as that's all they do, we'll probably manage. Is there like a repair? Let's have a look. It seems all right. They're clearing off again. Okay, well, I feel like we've managed. They're unhappy. I know they're unhappy. Happiness is, oh, 69, 70. It's not awful. Um, we should hopefully have, oh, no, still only, only f we need more forestry. I'm going to build another one of them. Um, industry. Where are you, Forester? Because you were, you were pretty useful. I'm going to build you out here. Um, Build the roll road first. They can only go on cleared land. Okay, well that might be enough. Let's have a look. Forester. 
Oh, you need to clear the trees. Wow. Okay, let's put you there. Let's see. And then hopefully when these cle trees get cleared, there we go, we can uh, we can finish the path up to it. Uh, it took too long to store a harvest. That's fine. We've got 220. I'm not, I'm not worried about that in the slightest. Um, people are dying of old age. That's good that we're managing to get that far. Still not quite ready for a windmill. The wood seems to be just going everywhere else, unfortunately. I suppose we just built that forestry, to be fair. But hopefully, there's 89 people now. There's got to be people without jobs. There's eight idle. So I'm hoping that this will provide jobs for three. We'll do a windmill that should provide jobs for... Is it just one? The, the old mill keeper? Is it just one guy? Yeah, one. Um, yeah, a few idols, not too bad, you know. But you don't want everyone just sitting around while you're needing more stuff. We're doing great for gold. In fact, if anything, you, we could probably... we could probably Why is happiness just dropped so low? We could probably drop the tax. Um, is it there? Let's just make it zero tax for a little while. Because we've got 824 gold. We'll have a tax-free couple of years. Um, 15 died of plague. Ouch. Hopefully that means the happiness will come up now. They're all, all the miserable ones are dead. <laughs> That's how my thinking is. Uh, so I've got 20 wood. Nearly there with it. I'm assuming these roads that we're building uh, are using wood. Yeah, one one wood for those. Okay, well, we'll just finish that off so the forestry is uh, linked. It doesn't have to be, but just my own point of view, I feel like it should. I'd love to know why happiness has just gone so low. Do they all get a bit miserable after a Viking attack or something? Uh, we're back up to a decent amount of stone. How much do these take to build? 15 stones. We should be able to build a good few of these. Four. 15, 30, 60. Yeah, this is alright. But look, we've got 58 stone. Oh, it uses wood as well. Ugh. Okay, well, hopefully. There we go. Forestry set up. Nobody working there just yet. Um, but I'm hoping that one fills up. There we go. So we fixed our forester issue. We now have wood coming in. Uh, looks like our food issue is uh, on top of at the minute. We've given them a tax break. We're just the most awesome uh, medieval king I, I i know i think there we go look at oh look we lost some then from the uh from the snow never mind um we've still got plenty in our stores okay cool so there we go after a little bit of a break we're kind of back on top of everything and the next one we'll look at pushing the expansion even further and they're uh, probably building the beginnings of like a second second town up up here i think is probably where we're going to go with it so thank you very much for watching hope you've enjoyed it if you have please give us a like it really does help out the channel and if you're not already don't forget to subscribe any thoughts queries or suggestions pop them down in the comments and if you fancy a chat you can find me on twitter i'm at john t sparrow and also don't forget to join in with the geekism community over on our discord server you'll find the link in the description It'd be good to see you there thanks very much for watching i'll see you in the next one Bye.